Hi there, I'm Suraj, a partner engineer at Meta for Llama. As an engineer, I know that maintaining an open source repo can be a fulfilling experience, but it also requires significant effort to triage issues, review PRs, and respond to comments in a timely fashion. So we built a tool to assist our maintainers by analyzing our repositories and generating insightful reports using Llama. In this tutorial, you'll learn how you can use Llama models to analyze unstructured data and generate useful reports for your team. While you can apply Llama to any analysis or reporting task, in this tutorial, we'll walk through GitHub issue triaging as our example to demonstrate these concepts. The GitHub triage tool fetches issues from a repository, analyzes and categorizes them, identifies key challenges that are being discussed, and generates comprehensive reports with visualizations all possible with Llama's language understanding capabilities. Let's kick things off by grabbing the raw data we want to analyze. In general, this could come from a database, file stores, but in our case, we're using the GitHub API to fetch issues from a repository. Next up, we bring in Llama to help us out. Since issue threads can get pretty long and cover a lot of ground, Llama summarizes each discussion to keep things clear and concise. But that's not all. We also use Llama to dig deeper and generate useful metadata like what category the issue falls into and how severe it is, which parts of the code base are being talked about, the sentiment and expertise level of the users involved, and possible causes of the issue and suggested fixes. To ensure consistency across inferences, we include a target JSON schema with our prompts, and in this way, all the outputs and metadata follow the same format making Llama's responses easy to work with downstream. All this info now gets neatly stored in a SQL database with one row per discussion. And this setup lets us do some cool downstream analysis like tracking how user sentiment has changed over the past couple of releases. Now, there's a lot of info to digest from all this. So we use Llama once again to generate a report. This report gives us an executive summary with key points and action items for our maintainers. The triage tool built with Llama helps us pinpoint the main challenges developers are facing so our engineering teams can focus on building the right solutions. Now let's break down the key building blocks of the system. Think of these as your foundation. You can use them to create your own custom triaging tool or even build a completely different reporting tool if you want. LLM.py, this is where all the magic happens with LLM inference. You can either deploy Llama locally or connect to a cloud provider of your choice over here. Config YAML holds all the important settings like your GitHub token, model configurations, and the prompts that guide how we generate issue summaries, metadata, and the final report. Utils comes with handy utility functions for fetching GitHub issues and processing the data. And to make things even easier, the codebase includes a walkthrough notebook that shows each step in code. Running the triage tool is straightforward. First, install the required dependencies. Next, update config.yaml. Set your GitHub token for API access. Choose between deploying Llama locally or using a cloud provider and customize your prompts and the JSON schemas. Finally, run the tool with a simple command. The GitHub triage tool showcases how Llama models can be used beyond simple text generation to create practical data analytics tools. By analyzing GitHub issues, it helps maintainers understand user pain points, identify recurring themes, and prioritize improvements. If you'd like to know more about the triage tool or start building with the code, head to the link in the description below and visit the Llama cookbook page. Hopefully this example is a solid starting point for you to build your own reporting and analytics systems using Llama models. Thanks for watching. Get started with Llama models on Llama.com and start building your own applications today. We're actively developing new features and capabilities, so join us on GitHub to stay up to date. We can't wait to see what you build.